Well, how y'all? It's me again, Uncle Dad. And producer wants me to talk to you. <laughs> I just love that word, producer. Because you see, back home where I come from, I think it's there in that direction. I'm not sure. But anyways, that word producer, back home means you're having a good year. Producing corn or vodka or, or barley or beans or moonshine. Or youngins. Mostly youngins. <laughs> but anyway, the producer wants me to talk to y'all for a minute or two, and I think it's just their way of holding you outside the barn until all the cows come home. In other words, in plain English, they're just trying to hold you off until they get our first show all right up and ready to go. <laughs> but but uh, the producer... <laughs> <laughs> There's that word again. <laughs> Once we tell you how that we, the fatties, we can't got to get our own show. Well, it's like this. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> the city slicker over there, or over there, or somewhere over here, they're all waving their hands. I sit there trying to tell me to hurry up and get to the meat of the story. Well, okay, that's all right. It's like this. <laughs> what? Yes, as sure as there's a two-faced critter in the White House. Yes, sir. You can bet on that one. Uh-huh. Now, anyway. Okay, okay. I, I'm, okay. I'm getting there. Anyway, it got to be that I was thinking, you know, there must be something stored up here in my story shed. Some kind of experience or memory that I could write about and share with the rest of the world. Now, I know that all the fatties down there in the holler and all the other folks in the holler wouldn't buy my book because what I was going to write about what I do write about was common sense down there it's just an everyday way of life so but I got to writing and I got to realizing that there are some fatties that have left down the holler they have left the holler they got on Route 23 and they just went all over the country they loaded up their flatbed truck and just left and never came back. And it's those fatties, it's those fatties that I want to reach with my book. Because you see, they got out there across the country and they, they went from hillbillies to rednecks. That's right, they went from hillbillies to rednecks and they done quit practicing our way, our holler tradition. And that ain't right. That just ain't right. So, I wrote a book. And it became a bestseller, and now we have moved from the horror to the hood. And here we are. But we ain't gonna be no rednecks. I can tell you that right now, we ain't gonna forget our family tradition. There ain't no way. But I wrote the book. Oh, the book, oh, by the way, yeah. Here it is, right here. Right there it is, folks. Right there. You see that? How to sweet talk your sister. A hillbilly's guide to love. That's right, it's written by me, is it? Yeah. <laughs> Uncle Dad, I'm the one that write that baby up. Yep. And if baby no money, I'm in the hood now. But I have found out though that across America, out there in this place called Utah, there is a group of people out there, fatties, they're fatties, that have kept our holler tradition up. That's right. They still live by our holler tradition. Now they even started a church, much like the one we got down home. But I just kept for the life of me understand why they went and changed the name. That's right. They changed the name from the Church of the Latter-day Fatties. Why would they do that? I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to get to reading my book again, and I'm going to find something to do there. And I'm going to get old Grammy. You can bet on that. Because it's a holler tradition. Now, Uncle Dad has never lied to you, and I ain't going to. We'll be here with our first show soon, as soon as they get it all right up, okay? So, until next time, all right, all right, settle down. Till next time, Uncle Dad is out. <laughs> oh, one more thing. If you don't find my book for sale at your local bookstore, you write me at Sykes Studio 
at yahoo.com and care of Uncle Dad. And I'll guarantee you I'll answer your questions right from the book. I'll give you the advice that you need to bag your sister. So rewrite me. Uncle Dad. Okay? You write me. Psych Studio. That's S-I-K-E-S-T-U-D-I-O at yahoo.com. And I'll write you right. That's a guarantee. Because Uncle Dad doesn't lie to you. Oh well. Ha, 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 ha.